actually, and the link I have there, if you guys are in the show notes, uh, it's actually an email I got. It says, we miss you at Moju. And I'm like, well, I didn't know that I missed Moju. And I don't know. Maybe I got on a list. Maybe this used to be another app that I tried out and I you downloaded it once. Did I cover this? I think so in an old show. We did. So so they, they did miss me at Moju. Uh, you just didn't miss them. I didn't miss them. Maybe I signed up for it. <laughs> Okay, a really, really good impression. Maybe, <laughs> maybe it's worth, uh, maybe it's worth revisiting a little bit. So I downloaded the app and I was like, okay, let's check it out. Their email marketing worked. Okay, uh, M O J U. If you want to check this out. Now, what happens is, uh, if you go to some of the samples here on their website, and let me pop that up. Uh, also, they caught my attention because there's a May Apple Watch giveaway. So if you go make some mojus, uh, you're automatically entered. So. This is this was my experience first popping into this. So you make these. It looks like Instagram. It looks so much like Instagram. It's ridiculous, right? Look at that font. Look at that blue bar across the top. But what happens is if you're on the web, I'm moving my mouse left to right, and you see an animation happen, right? Now I haven't made one of these yet, but uh, and also you guys are familiar with uh, Facebook when they do images and they're. Is it paper? It was that that application they did, and there's that you know you move your phone and it moves from side to side, mm-hmm. and that is happening here with this glass of iced tea and and the uh, light over it. You know, it 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 it's, it it's catching that accelerometer and it's adding movement to it. Now, I'm kind of curious, how do I make one? I haven't looked at that yet, but uh, I mean, again, it's one of those like it's a cool idea. When I think that we we were talking about when we talked about this, we, we were talking about like 3D. Because you can you can definitely give like a three D effect to things, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Um, like you could three D almost scan like a action figure or something along those lines. Um, and I think we were talking about this back when Vine first started. Like the, the, that's where I want to think that we we kind of started the conversation. But it, it it's an interesting concept. The one thing I will say that does not lend itself well is the web interface. Having right. to drag your um, cursor across the picture left to right does not work as well as using the accelerometer, to your point, on the phone. You can actually do I did one real quick here in the studio uh, that should be posting to my Facebook, I think. Uh, it's actually uploading right now. It is just you, you move your, your phone in a motion, and, and that's it. And... Uh, you guys can see here in the studio what's going on. I want to see if I can get the Facebook oh. on there as Your well. Your Facebook came up. Oh, my Facebook came up? Oh, Facebook error. Oh, I wasn't able to share to Facebook. That's interesting. Oh. But, you know, you just get that little bit of a movement. Wee. And, you know, and this is just moving my phone back and forth. So it's like a motion Instagram, and I'm still kind of figuring out, why would I do this? <laughs> you know, um, I... I I don't know what the audience is there. I feel like this is something. I think this would be interesting if it integrated into Instagram. Like if this was a feature of Instagram, I think I think like people would they would take advantage of that more than say video, mm-hmm. for instance. So worth looking at. Check it out, Moju Labs. <laughs> but, I find it completely addicting though. Yeah. Like, and that's the hook. <laughs> <laughs> Like I could, I could sit here. Like this is bad. Like I could sit here for quite some time and just. Oh, look neat. at the kitty. <laughs> <laughs> but like, no, I mean, like I go to their website and check them out because, like, you mm-hmm. just sit here and I, I feel like and I don't want to stop hitting load more. And this one, this has a lot of stuff, and they're putting multiple images in here, and you have to really move your mouse slow. In order to go look through this labyrinth, stonehenge looking thing, you know, I mean, it's you can do a lot with it, and maybe you can do something and kind of you can make like '80s music video looking stuff out of this. There's no audio though. That There's no audio. Kind of... It's all visuals. Here's one that's like definitely a bunch of different pictures, and you can see uh, the vertical horizontal pictures go kind of crazy, uh, you know. So it doesn't really work out all that great. Or here's one where you create a little bit of an animation coming around. You know, just you know, this is just them kind of plugging their hashtag uh, campaign here. Uh, it's interesting. It is interesting. It's not video, and I'm also curious to see how does this play out on Facebook as well. So maybe that's something that we'll be playing with over the next week. So.